Rancangan untuk membangunkan semula kawasan Highland Towers sebagai taman rekreasi masih dalam proses perancangan. Timbalan Menteri Perumahan dan Kerajaan Tempatan, Senator Datuk Raja Kamarul Bahrain Shah Raja Ahmad berkata kawasan tersebut perlu dipantau dengan lebih terperinci dan mengambil kira kedudukannya di lereng bukit yang terdedah dengan risiko tanah runtuh. We don't know whether <coughs> how safe it is but we're not taking the risk at the moment because uh, there's no real need to uh, impose any structure on that area because there has been evidences of uh, instability of that area so why take the risk because we have much more land available nearby in the Klang Valley and Kuala Lumpur so in terms of priority this is we consider as a, a sensitive area to be avoided unless it's absolutely necessary Beliau berkata demikian pada sidang media selepas melancarkan Kongres Dunia Persatuan Sisa Pepejaan Antarabangsa ISWA 2018 di Pusat Konvensyen Kuala Lumpur pada Isnin. Sementara itu, Ketua Setiausaha Kementerian Perumahan dan Kerajaan Tempatan Datuk Sri Muhammad Mentek berkata pihaknya sudah mengadakan beberapa pertemuan dengan jawatan kuasa pembangunan semula Highland Towers bagi mencari cara pembangunan semula yang sesuai. So, so far, we have identified... Uh, finally, we know the total numbers of uh, units at the Highland Towers, it's about 150. And then we also have identified some of the owner. And then um, uh, now we are in the midst of uh, discussing with ECRAM and also uh, PWD, Public Work Department or JKR, to do a study on the uh, structure of the, of the land. So uh, after that study, then uh, we are going to have another meeting. And then we are planning to do uh, to see all the parties also involved to discuss the way forward of like what we mentioned just now. To what will be the future of that area? Terdahulu, Menteri Perumahan dan Kerajaan Tempatan Zuraida Kamrudi mengumumkan bahawa kawasan kondominium Highland Towers yang terbiar sejak 25 tahun lalu berikutan tragedi yang mengorbankan 48 nyawa penghuninya akan dijadikan taman rekreasi dalam masa terdekat.